Thoughts on the Cristiano Ronaldo bottle incident. Are you familiar with this? I am not. You are. Okay. So, ironically enough, Impy has a bottle on his table with no label, which is what Ronaldo did. So, the Euro Cup is going on. Ronaldo, obviously, the biggest star at the Euro Cup, without a doubt. Portugal, the team who is going to contend. They won their first match 3-0. They're playing in Budapest after the game ends. You do press conferences. And it's like a, it's a table and it has, it says Budapest. It says Euro 2020. They've kept it 2020. They didn't adjust it because of the marketing. Mm-hmm. All the billions of dollars they wasted. So anywho, Ronaldo sits down and there is a Coca-Cola bottle here. Ronaldo, in front of him. In front of him. Ronaldo takes the bottle, puts it off to the side where you can't see it. Grabs his water bottle, which is like this, no label. You know, it wasn't like it was Poland Spring or Dasani. And he goes, drink water. Puts it down, and it's in the shot. That resulted in a $4 billion hit on the stock price. For Coke? For Coke. On the market value of Coke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the stock went down. Thoughts? That's wild, but it's, do, you, do you think it's because it's Ronaldo? Or is it the stage, the platform? Is it a is it a whirlwind of all of those things? I think it's a combination of all those things. Um, I think when we say the term, when we say the phrase, the juice is temporary, but the sauce lasts forever. Yeah. That's what we mean by having the sauce. Yeah. Because dude just moved the bottle out of the way and it, like plummeted the stock. It was hysterical. Unless you're coke, then you're devastated for that. But it's very similar to remember the Olympic team in '92. If you watched the Last Dance. Was it like Puma was a sponsor or Adidas for and the then, Dream Team? Or like Champion? And when USA won the gold, MJ has the American flag over. And initially, everyone's like, oh, mad patriotic. Whatever, he's whatever. covering the brand. But he's covering the brand because he's Team Nike. He's Team Jordan. Ronaldo, though, what I found funny, unless you're a Coke supporter or Coke backer, is it's not like he promoted something else. He just said, drink water, because dude spends $2 million on his fucking body, and he looks shredded. Mad abs. But do they have a deal with Coca-Cola? So the Coke is sponsoring the Euro Cup. So it's like the Champions League is sponsored by Heineken. It's yeah, the official yeah. beer, you know, like uh, even Blue Wire, the official beer of Blue Wire is Coors Light, right? So it's like everyone has an official X, Y, Z, whatever it might be, of a certain, a certain company and brand. But it was just crazy to see, like, that's it's, dude, it's a 20 second video. Yeah. I mean, look, if you know anything about the stock market, though, this is what happens stock goes down, you buy it when it's low, buy the dip, you buy the dip, and you make it, and it goes back up. So, is this, is this like a interesting type of a maybe like case study for like someone studying marketing and, the market or something like that cool yeah but i don't think this is that big of a deal i don't think it is either a question on top of this question asked by our our friend in the discord does that even matter anymore like product placing in front of like an influencer kind of like and what i mean by that is me now i'm speaking on my behalf this is gonna sound mad ignorant i get it but i've never been like oh shit they're wearing this i gotta get that or this guy is wearing that watch. It's I, never been something that like steered me in that direction. I feel like they, tr- I feel like brands are trying to do it now more like more low key. They're not trying to throw it in your face. Maybe it's a brand on a t-shirt, a, a small branding on a T, maybe something in the background. I feel like it, when it's less invasive, it could potentially be more effective if they're not trying to just s- slam it in your face. Hey yo, hey yo! <laughs> I sell more crewnecks when I don't say that I'm selling crewnecks, and I just wear them on the pot. And they're like, "Oh shit, that was dope. Where can I get one?" Oh, yeah. as a matter of fact, this is how you can get one. Bing. I feel like Essentia water blew up because of the Kardashians. They're yeah. just not even like just that's what they drank, but it, they weren't. Oh, drink Essentia! They, they, right, they were, right. They were just subtle, subtle, subtle. Part of your lifestyle. Uh, Kendall, uh, not Kendall. Kylie Jenner one time said that the Snapchat filter, she didn't like it, and like Snapchat went down. Another one. Juice is temporary, so it lasts forever. Yeah. For me personally, the way I go about buying things is word to mouth with people that I trust and friends. Yeah. Right. So it's like, you tell me about the scooter that you got that electrical shit popping. Go tracks. 
popping. Go buy that. <laughs> they didn't pay us, so maybe don't unless they give us a sponsor. Pay us money. But that that's the kind of that's how I am when I buy things. Man. It's like, yo, you or or even with like movies and shows, it's word like, of yo, mouth. Yo, you gotta watch this new show on Netflix. It's popping, and then it's like, all right, it be told me about watching Game of Thrones, Breaking Bad, or whatever other shit you might have told me in the past. Then it's like, oh, all right, I'm gonna go and check that out. You know, yeah. you ever have a friend of you tell you like, yo, you gotta listen to this song. That's a banger. And then you listen to it, and it's like crickets. And you're like, all right, next time he tells me to listen to that song, I'm probably not gonna listen to it. Yeah, no. To your point though, I think it's uh, when when when. Uh, <laughs> you said hey yo <laughs> sorry i just could stop uh yeah I, pay us go track scooters um i was gonna say generally speaking though i feel like if someone goes out of their way to like recommend something to me a lot of the times i will enjoy it like word of mouth it will be effective as opposed to like anyone could buy advertising anyone mm. could buy ads right like but that like word of mouth marketing is effective because to your point, it's a trusted advisor. It's someone that you know, hey, this I know this person. They're not just trying to sell me on something. They're just doing it because they genuinely think I'd be interested in it and I'd enjoy it. That stuff seems to be more effective. Yeah, and even like the ad reads that I do, it's 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 a cosign on my end. Like, yeah, I fuck with all of them. It's too. always more effective when you've used the product. Yeah, and, for yeah. sure. Yeah, for sure.